So um, I'll give you a tour of um, my Chernobyl hotel. This is the hallway, and uh, this is me. So, uh, first of all, this is the uh, bedroom, and uh, the beds are really narrow, so that's going to be an interesting night's sleep. Uh, so there's two beds in here anyway. I was considering trying to push them together, but it's not going to work. Um, so, through here, got like a little lounge living room area the TV with the uh, nice random Ukrainian TV mm. hoping there might be some Champions League football on them one of the channels a bit later but we'll have to see about that one there's actually a fridge in here which I find quite random because there isn't a kitchen here but there is a there is a fridge um, I don't know. Let me have a bathroom. Pretty standard. Pretty clean. Hello. Um, yeah, you noticed there's no shower. It's just a basin and a toilet. No shower because there is actually a separate room that is just a shower. Check that out. Check it. Yeah. Nice. I'm going to be using that in a minute. Get all this contaminated dust off me. Um, and that's it really. Nothing really much to say apart from that there looks a bit suspicious, but you know. I'm not sleeping directly under it, so that's all good. And uh, yeah, well, you know, can't complain. Um, I was actually told that this place is actually um, originally built for the liquidators to um, stay in when they were busy clearing out um, Chernobyl. Um, so uh, nothing's changed, apparently. Still all original furnishings and cool curtains. And uh, apart from that desk looks relatively modern. Well, I say modern, but compared to everything else in this room, it's pretty modern. Um, yeah, that's about it. <laughs>